is everybody? Welcome back. It is Hank Dad back for another Hank Dad video. Hopefully y'all like it. I finally got a creep in here. Game volume. <clears throat> Excuse me. Anyways, so uh, we're back here on the repo. I'm trying to go repo uh, like uh, the true removal repo, true removal, and just keep it going like that. So that's what we're doing today. We got the Chevy. We got the two number five on it. So go ahead and head out of the driveway here. Try not to hit any more poles. Alright, there we go, there we go. Think about alright. Um I'm gonna turn that vehicle volume down just a tad to a little bit. Loud. I don't think that helps, but so alright, very nice. We got two repo one Maybe two vehicles. I'm not for sure. We might be able to get both of them knocked out today. Just not for sure. Oh, took a wrong turn. We'll head back up here. Yeah, so we're going to be repoing two vehicles today. We might as well just do both of them, get them both out of the way. I'm thinking, guys, there's this tree company that does like tree removal and stuff. I'm thinking if they can just come out here and remove this for me. That'd be awesome. I'll probably give them a call tomorrow or something. Because I got these shops placed here. It's still early in the morning. Uh, it's 23.05. I think that's that's farming sometime. So guys, right here we got the Razor. We repoed last episode. We repoed this Polaris Razor 1000. Super cool. Super cool. So we're going to put this up for sale. I was thinking maybe 20000 25000 Something like that. So we're going to clean it up and stuff actually right now before we forget we're going to go ahead and buy us a power washer that way we can have all of our equipment just cleaned up ready to put out on the lot I think is what we're going to be doing we'll just throw the power washer right there all right. and all of our stuff comes with full tanks of gas and everything so there we go we'll go ahead I'll activate the power washer spray these tires off they're kind of dirty there. There we go. Get that cleaned up. Somebody, I cannot remember who commented on a video. It was if I play Farming Simulator, I mean Farming USA, can they play with me? Um, uh, for now, guys, we're going to be done with that, and I think FS19 is where we're going to be playing. So, uh, from USA and FS17, I think they're gonna be done. Cause really, uh, I've seen based off of stuff, a lot of people enjoy these farming sim videos, and uh, so that's what I'm trying to get it to you guys like this. So, alright, we're gonna go ahead and let the tailgate down. There we go. I'm thinking about starting like not only repo, but like hauling livestock for people and everything. I think that'd just be super neat do that and one thing was we're gonna we're not even gonna clean out the truck because it's not for sale it's kind of just a company truck I guess and it's my daily driver so I don't think it really needs to be cleaned off but we're gonna just look at the engine real quick make sure everything's running might need to run to the hardware store or the gas station should have just some oil I can throw in it real quick yeah it's gonna need some oil I bought this truck it's a brand new 2020 truck. It's got like however many miles I put on it. It's got 0.8 hours on the truck, so not bad at all. But uh, the thing is, they had a lot of testing hours. I mean, testing miles. So it's got about not a lot, but 15,000. I mean, it's it's 2020 Euromax, 15,000 miles. Is it terrible? But uh, it is quite a few for brand new. So. We're going to, it has a hindi. They told me when I bought it, I need to change the oil sometime. And uh, when it gets over an hour of use. So, which obviously, guys, one hour of this is like nothing. I mean, it, it takes a long time to get an hour on a vehicle, I feel like. But it's not that big of a deal. So, when it gets over an hour, we're going to throw some oil on it. But we're going to finish our repo before that does that. So, like, we're not going to put oil on it right now. We're, if it goes over one, it's okay, I guess. But the repo should just be directly in front of me. It should be directly in front of me. I kind of know where it's at. 
So this guy, he lives in an apartment. I'm not for sure where. I think it's down there. That building down there. I feel like that's. Sorry guys. I feel like that's his apartment building and stuff. So uh, and right there is where he keeps his truck. It's an F-250 high boy. So we're just gonna go this way. I'm kind of. I should have pulled into that parking lot. Uh, all right, let me back up real quick. And we're gonna pull into this parking lot. Like, right now, he doesn't know that I'm. Right now, he doesn't know that I'm doing anything. Sorry about that, guys. I'm sister. So he doesn't know. He probably just thinks I'm just coming here to, you know, just, to stop, eat or something. If this is a cafe, I'm not sure. But uh, we're actually here to repo truck. So right now, we don't have to be sneaky. If I can get in here, I have to run over a couple cars. But we're gonna park this. Just right here. I'm gonna go ahead and unfold it. We're just gonna shut the truck off. He's probably getting a little suspicious, but I don't. I think he lives down there. It's an F-250 high boy. It's got just normal stock wheels on it. Is the description it just said F-250 high boy? Stock wheels. It's that's kind of a weird description. I don't know why they'd want to mention the wheels, but I think this is our truck. And I don't think there's anybody around. I'm trying to think. Okay, um, yeah, this has got to be our truck. Um, see the plate number? He never did tell the bank. Okay, so it doesn't even have plates. Okay, that's okay. So this thing, that might be one of the reasons why it's getting repoed. It doesn't even have plates on it. Okay. Oh, oh yes, the keys work. Yes. Okay, number one repo is going smooth so far. We're just gonna. Uh, okay, keys. Okay, it's like a greenish color. I'm not sure I like that. But anyways, he's gonna get a little bit suspicious, probably, if he hears his drug, which he probably has already. Oh, right there. We're just gonna hurry on out of here. <laughs> Typical day, Dermax pulling forward. Alright, oh my goodness, I think it's about popped off there. We're just gonna try and get it back to my shop. I think it's gonna be the move here. Alright, my shop should just be right down here. And then the other one is another one of a beach house. We got a lot of beach house repos, I feel like. But the bank, I guess that's they're just sending me out there. I don't know why. But uh yeah, so we got a lot of beach houses. That I guess people just have these big nice luxurious beach houses and they just cannot keep them paid or something. I don't I don't know. Like if you're gonna buy this stuff. I would have the money to get up. I get it. Some people get into financial troubles, but I mean, if you got a five hundred thousand dollar beach house, I'm guessing if you got that, you should probably be able to afford a fifty thousand dollar truck. I'm just saying. I mean, maybe some people couldn't. Yeah, I get that, but I mean, dude, come on. <laughs> but it doesn't matter to me. I'm just here to get them. Alright, and then we do not own this truck, but we, we're we going to try and buy it, I think. It's a really nice F-250. It's a, it, I think it's a high boy. Right, we're just going to throw this one over here. Yeah, we're just going to put it right next to it. We're not directly next. Oh my goodness, I think it has some big old lights on it. But anyways, we're just going to put this one right here. And I... We'll sign the papers with the bank and stuff to get that truck to be mine. So, all we gotta do is sign a couple papers because the bank owes me money for repoing these. They give me a, a fair amount of money to repo them, and then I just pay them a little bit more for the vehicle. This vehicle is worth around $10,000 is what the bank says it's worth. But, uh, it may be worth more than that. I don't know, really. But, uh, then I'll charge them a thousand to repo it, then I just give them my thousand dollars and we call it even so that's the move um let's see our next repo i think is a beach house so let's see uh, let's go to the map here okay so i think it was down in here okay so there is a yellow dot here and i think the yellow dots mean that that's where it's at so right here is our we're right here in this area right here we need to be right here so i'm thinking about hitting this main so we're gonna go down this way go out this road, hit this road, cross up and over, and then go and pull into here. I do not know where, why that thing, okay, it, I don't even know. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and just 
start trucking down there, I guess, and uh, we'll see what happens. I do not know what's going to happen. Okay, I think I might have took the wrong road. If I'm, is there a road that goes to the left? If I need to be on the left. Um, da -da 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 -da. Okay, there should be a road down here. My bad, I took the wrong road. Okay, yes, there is a road. Oh my goodness, this is going to be tight. Oops. Okay, I did not do that. You guys did not see that. Alright, let's try and make a turn here. Mm, this is going to be tough. Let's try and keep it going. Okay. I was just trying to do something. Oh, darn it. This just leads us to that. Alright. There's a road literally right up here, guys. I'm just going to try and get the dirt bikes up there. No. Okay, forget that. Forget that idea. Come on, dude, let me back out of this. Alright, we just got to back up. one more idea. Do not drag. Okay. Just just get up there. Come on. Darn it. Okay, that's not gonna work. Forget it. Just get out of this. Alright, come on. At least we got four wheel drive because my back wheels weren't even touching the ground. Alright. I can just back out of this one. Okay, that'll that'll be fine. Oh, no. Just keep on backing I guess what we could do. Alright. We'll just back on out of here and then sorry about this guys. I mean a teeny bit unreal not a teeny bit. We might have a problem. Um, I just wrapped it literally around a pole. That cannot be good. Oh my goodness, you're actually kidding me. Uh, there we go. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. We gotta get these repos because if I don't get these vehicles repoed, I'm not making any money. And then they're gonna have to come repo my stuff. So. We do not want the bank to repo our stuff. They'll just hire us to repo. <laughs> Alright, anyways. Um, Alright, we're just going to go down here. Alright, there we go. Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm sorry, guys. I'm being so unrealistic. This is kind of funny, though. Alright, let's go, let's go. Dude, I'm loving this Dermax. wasn't good. I was trying to go around that car. Don't you even think about me. That guy kind of sounded like a train. Dermax roaring. Alright, let's keep going. And I think we're going to hit this road. Right here, so. Turn on the blinker. And then we're going to take this road right here. Oh my goodness. Got another vehicle leasing cost in it. For the loan interest, darn it. We got a big loan out. No, we really need to repay that. Alright, now I'm going to hit this road right here. No, there's a train coming. Darn it. Just go. Full throttle. Full throttle. It. Dude, did I just beat that train? Y'all, that train just about creamed me. I was trying to stop. I was like, nope, there's no stopping this thing. We gotta keep going. Oh, man, that was close. Dude, we gotta start with this truck. Alright. It says it's in this area here somewhere. I'm not for sure. We're gonna park the truck. We can maybe loop it back around. I think we should. Oh, I think we should be able to park it right here. We're not even gonna unfold the ramps. We gotta, gotta go look for this truck. Um, any cars? Okay, yep, there's a car. We're gonna let it go real quick. Okay, go, okay. authorized vehicles only. Okay, so it's a company, it looks like. Let's take out the American flag. It's a company, I guess. Oh, cool little lights and stuff. I'm looking. Maybe it's around the back in this. See, I was thinking they might have hit it like in here or something. Maybe? I don't know, actually. It's not there. It's down here. I don't think it would... I don't think it will be fit in there. It's not in there. Um, I don't think it's around here, no. Alright, um, let me just open that up. Actually, do not open the store. Alright. Alright, it's not around here. Um, this is like a totally different company over here, I think. So I'm gonna climb this ladder. Oh, no, they're not gonna let me climb my ladder. Alright, um, it doesn't seem to be back here. We'll go check, though. 
Now, I want to be completely sure it's not around here. The yellow dot indicates where, like, it doesn't indicate where the vehicle exactly is. It indicates an area. So, you know, you got to check the whole thing. All right, so it's not around here. Um, doesn't seem to be behind it, I don't think. I mean, you got some boats out there and stuff, but I don't see, it's a, we're looking for another truck. It's a Chevy, they say it's a Chevy Dually. It's a car. It's a Chevy and it's a Dually truck, flatbed. Not for sure. Um, not for sure where it's at. We searched all this, and I got a shipping container, I guess. Really just walk underneath this thing. I mean, I don't think it's up here. Oh, what the heck? Okay. It's not back here. Doesn't seem to be. Um, we'll go look back here. Real quick. Okay. Uh, no, it's not back there. Guys, I don't even know if we got the right location. I think we got. Maybe it's like down. Down. What the? What, wait, what? Wait, no, uh, wait, can this be their truck, guys? Wait. Could this be our truck? Wait a minute, hang on. Um, I don't think I'll be able to see it from back here, but... Is this our truck? Dude, okay, so it's got the flatbed right there, as you can tell, the flatbed. Huh. This is very odd. Okay, guys, I think this is our truck. They got a car here, so we better hurry up. Um, yeah, okay, this is our truck. Chevy Dermot, yeah. Why is this thing not starting? Yo, what is wrong with this truck, dude? No, -uh, what what is wrong with this thing? Okay. Yo, what is that? Okay, dude, we better hurry. Oh, okay, we got it, we got it, we got it. Hurry, drive out, drive out, drive out. Oh, this truck is loud. We're just, we're just gonna go, we're just gonna go. I think somebody was following us, dude. I kinda just wanna leave my truck here. Oh my goodness, okay, um, I don't know whether just to leave my truck here. Dude, somebody is literally over there. I saw them. Oh my goodness, dude. Forget it. We're just gonna hurry. Just hurry, 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 hurry. Okay, let the ramps down. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, the ramps are down. Let's go. Let's oh, dang it, they're not. They're not. Oh my goodness, guys. This is crazy. Are the ramps down? Okay, yes, the ramps are down. Hurry, 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 hurry. Somebody was literally over there. I don't know where they went or what they're doing. They must be looking for us or something. Yo, this is not good. Alright, just, just hurry. I'm just gonna get out of here as fast as I can. Let's go. Alright, turn off the lights. Let's go. Chevy on Chevy here, boys. The 2020's not even squatting, but we gotta get out of here fast. I don't even know where I'm going. Okay, uh, we're not gonna go that windy road. We're just gonna go this way. There we go. Break a little bit. Just keep it going through town. Okay, we're gonna, uh, I could just turn right here. Yep, that's what we're gonna do. Just go ahead and turn right here. Keep going. I'm not even using turn signals, boys. I'm not even pulled over. I'm just gonna tell I was in a, such a big rush, dude. I think I could have had a gun or anything. That could have been bad. Oh my goodness. Okay. Just gotta hurry. Just hurry. Now we're gonna go service my truck. Oh, don't hurry that fast. Do not hurry that fast. Oh my goodness, we do not wanna. Okay, that's fine. No big deal, no big deal. We'll just go ahead and throw it back on the trailer. I mean, I don't think anybody was actually, like, chasing us. I think one guy was looking around while I got in it and was trying to start it. Like, there was a guy at that factory or whatever you want to call it. He was, like, looking around or something, but I do not think he got in a car and chased me. Um, he might have, though. You just never know. Uh, we just gotta hurry and get this thing back to our shop. Our shop is pretty secret, I would say. I mean, I would call it secret, but two repos down today, guys. Maybe, if we don't get shot during this one. But two repos down. Um, Alright, we can go ahead and just turn signal real quick. That was just crazy. We could have got killed. Um, now we're gonna try and get these sold on off of the lot. Hopefully. Maybe we get a customer. I don't know. Um, yeah, dude, this tree guy, he had better hurry up and get here, because 
I gave him a call. I mean, I have my phone in my truck, so I did give him a call. I don't know where he's at, though. Okay, we just gotta hurry and get this thing up here. Our, our shop is kind of hidden because we got all these trees and stuff. But we're gonna try and get some of these trucks sold as soon as possible. I'll go ahead and yank this thing off here. And then throw it in here. Um, yeah, so then we got two repos done. We got the F-250 highway, and then we got this truck. Those were today's thing. And then, uh, and then yesterday we got the Razor. Hopefully we can get some of this sold. I already have the Razor in the paper. Fresh up. I need to figure out a place where we can actually put these, like, out on the road or something. Think about having that tree guy, or whatever his name is. I think it's, like... Todd Squad tree removal or something like that. Maybe I'm gonna have him remove this tree. Um, let me get out of these bushes. But like have him remove some trees around the area. Cause I mean we need to have a nice little shop area. And I'm thinking about putting it. Okay, that house looks like it's being built. But I'm thinking that's actually really sweet. Hang on, let me get over here. We got some stairs already done and stuff. Oh, that's really neat. We got a construction company over there. Alright, anyways. Back to what I was saying, though. I'm thinking about maybe putting... My problem is uh, putting a dealership kind of out here. But my problem is there's houses and stuff. There's just water tower. I don't think I can get rid of that, unfortunately. But maybe just have, like, a nice little road going back through here. And then people can come back here and buy stuff. Kind of make a little showroom or something like that. But that's my plan. I'm actually going to probably start the road in this video, but guys, tomorrow's video is going to be a tree removal video, and we might, uh, I don't know where we're going to be removing trees at, honestly, we're just going to drop the trailer right there, and I forgot we got to drop the tailgate down, there we go, alright, let's go ahead and start, oh wait, dang it, I cannot start any construction, can I, I have no money, I think we're at the maximum on our loan. We could literally borrow five thousand dollars. Okay, hang on. Let's go here. Let's go to sheds. Okay, this little shed is nine thousand. We have thirteen grand. I doubt it's gonna let me buy it, but if we can get this put right about here. Okay. Okay. Hang on. It collides with the tree. Is my problem. Like right there. Okay, yeah, um, we're, we're gonna figure that out. Maybe we'll have to wait for a sell or something to get this going, but hopefully y'all are enjoying the video. If anybody wants to play FS19 with me, I will try and, well, I won't try. I will get it set up to where you guys can if you want to jump on. Maybe you'll be a customer here, and, uh, try and think of a name. Think of a name for our dealership, and, uh, if you do, I'll give you a big old shout-out. So, uh, just think of a, a good, clever name. Throw it in the comments section, and if... If you, if you just put any name down there, don't put like a some dumb name, but okay, I went the wrong way. Not like Mouse Poop Store or something like that, but like a good name for the shop. Let me know if you think of one, and I will give you a big shout out. So, guys, I really do appreciate it. I'm trying to find the exit. Okay, here it is. Okay, very nice. And then we're going to go throw some oil on this truck. But then, uh, if you guys think of a name, I'll give you a big old shout out. And then, if you guys want to play with me, Throw in the comment section, like, Hank, hey, I, I got a PC, you know, I just got FS19, uh, I want to play with you, yeah, I'll let you play, no problem. so, okay, we're just gonna go ahead, shut the truck off, we're gonna, oh, perfect, right here's a little repair shop, I didn't even know this was here, okay, maybe the guy is still open, alright, um, not for sure on this one, uh, Looks like he's still in there. I mean, it's really early in the morning, but looks like he'd be in there. Um. All right, maybe we just go inside the gas station. Is this the gas station? Okay, this is a rundown-looking gas station, boys. Okay, yeah, no, no, over here is the gas station. All right, we're gonna go over here. Sorry about that. We're gonna grab some oil. Ding, 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 ding. See if anybody comes to the door. It said ring doorbell for assistance, so. 
We'll see, we'll see. Oh, what the heck? Oh, that's neat. They got a little window, okay. Where's your little window? Oh, is this like a little intercom thing? All right, hello? Hello? I don't think that's an intercom. All right, yep, yep. I need one quart of oil, please. Yep, one quart. Thank you for that. All right, we're gonna go dump this in the truck, guys. Oh, we're just gonna set it right there real quick. Open up the hood. Guys, if you guys like the roleplay, let me know by hitting that like button. Alright, we're gonna grab our can of oil. As you guys can tell, I don't know if you guys like me telling you this. Alright, we're just gonna go ahead, jump up here on the hood a little bit. And right there. Oh, I'm gonna drop my can of oil. There we go. Just put it in there. Very nice. Alright, if you guys uh, like the roleplay, let me know by hitting that like button. And, uh,. But as you guys can tell, I I didn't have any oil. I didn't go in the gas station talking about it. It was just like it was just a role play. But if you guys like that, and if you guys don't like me telling you that, let me know. But if you guys like the role play, let me know. We're gonna go ahead and fill up with some gas. I don't think we need any gas, honestly. Yep. Um. Nope. We're good. All we needed was oil. Very nice. We're gonna go ahead, roll on out of the gas station. I'm gonna clear that. We'll go back to my house, and, uh, yeah, so, but like I said, if you guys want to be a customer here on the dealership, let me know. You guys can be our very first customer by the very first whatever you want. Hopefully, maybe we get a, a trailer repo. That'd be neat, because then I can sell a whole package, but you never know. So, guys, if you want to be the first customer, throw it in the comments section, and just say, hey, I got a new PC, I got Farming Simulator, or if you don't even have a new PC, and you got Farming Sim 19, and you download some mods let me know and uh you can be the first customer here or you just get on it and help me with the repo or something but guys if you got a name for the dealership leave it in the comments it helps me out a ton guys hopefully y'all did enjoy this video there should be a tree removal video coming out tomorrow so guys i really hope you guys did enjoy and i'll see you all on the next hank todd video